Good evening, I'm Mandy Noel. For the first time in history, a sitting president addressed the Ohio Republican Party at its state dinner. About 2,000 people were there to see the president in Columbus tonight. 27 First News State House reporter Jason Aubrey has our top story at 11. It was a packed house tonight as President Trump spoke to Republicans about the importance of electing their colleagues to office. The president's visit had several purposes, one of which was to promote some of the statewide races, like the gubernatorial race, in which the president took aim at Mike DeWine's opponent, former Ohio treasurer and attorney general Richard Cordray. His name is Cordray, and he's trouble. He's a guy that is real trouble. It's a very important thing. He'll destroy your state. Cordray will destroy your state. He had no overtly disparaging remarks about U.S. Senator Sherrod Brown's character, but did point out that Brown has voted against the president's wishes on several occasions. The president touted his own accomplishments and then returned to the candidates he was here to back. We will never give in, we will never give up, and we will never stop fighting to make America great again. I talked to state lawmakers before the president spoke about having him here in Ohio, and if they were concerned, it would carry unintended results. Tonight is about unifying the Republican Party uh, behind the president in support of our candidates all the way down uh, the ticket. I do think the president, of course, has tremendous influence on elections. I do believe, of course, that he is an individual that you either love or, or hate him. But I also believe that, that people vote, hopefully, for the individual that's serving them. One notable Republican absent tonight was Governor John Kasich. Kasich and Trump have been feuding. Recently, Kasich trolled Trump on Twitter by posting a picture of a laughing Vladimir Putin in response to a tweet from the president claiming Kasich was unpopular. President Trump made no mention of Kasich tonight. At the State House, Jason Aubrey, WKBN 27 First News.